What's up guys, Julian here. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be talking about the iPhone 14 Pro and whether it will or whether it will not work with my DJI Osmo Mobile 3. In order for us to see if this is going to work, this is a big phone and I need to have, you know, just a relatively affordable protector type case on it, but something that's not too bulky because I know for sure if it's too bulky, it's not going to fit. So I went and picked this one up. This is Spigen, S-B-I-G-E-N. I think that's how you pronounce it for the iPhone 14 Pro Max. This was about 20 bucks at Best Buy. Obviously an iPhone. Here's the phone right here. And we're gonna set up our DJI Osmo Mobile 3. We're gonna see if this is gonna work. So I'm just gonna hit prop that up so you can see that. Slide that out the way. Put the bottom out on real quick. We're gonna put on a nice shirt for the video too. So. <laughs> Always got to dress nice for the ladies, right? All right, here we go. Got to line up these lines up here at the top. Put the phone in. Centered. All right. We've got we've got a green, got some green light here. Now we just got to balance it out. Let's see here. Balance it a little bit. Okay, fire it up, whoop, all right, now I have to connect it to the app, let me see here, we're going to connect this to the app, I'm going to turn on my screen recording real quick, okay, we are gonna pull up the, as soon as I can find it, there it is, right there. Got it downloaded from the cloud. <laughs> Meanwhile, please like and subscribe to my channel. If you'd like to see more content about the iPhone 14 Pro, I have a Pro Max in this particular case. I'll have a playlist on my channel, all the videos on there as I add more and more content. Uh, once again, do like and subscribe. And if you got any suggestions for videos that you'd like for me, to experiment with this guy. Shoot me a message, post a comment. Hey, it's a party, it's a party, y'all. So, once again, iPhone 14 Pro, DJI Osmo Mobile 3. As soon as this thing finishes downloading. And we're done. All right, here we go. I'm gonna find it up. The DJI, I had to download the DJI Mimo app. This is a new phone, so I gotta do all that stuff. Would you like to find a connected device on the network? Bluetooth, yes. There we go, connect, request, request a pair, boom, pair, device, access to camera, sure. Allow access to photos, microphone, now good. We see. There we go. It's following me, yes sir. Okay, iPhone 14 Pro Max on the DJI Osmo Mobile 3, connected, mounted, it's following me everywhere I go. We got some action. Hold on, do I do the gesture again if I want it to stop? Yes, do the gesture again if you want it to stop. There we go. So it is working. Bop, bop, double click. Go into this mode, let me see here. Checking to see if there's any issues with, uh... man, that visual, man, it's like super crisp display on the backside. Yes, sir, let's see here, swing up. Obviously that's gonna block that, but there's a way around that. You swing it around the opposite way and then boom. I can walk around. That is just my crazy cat. There we go. Walk around like that. 
and not have to worry about the arm getting in the way of the shot. So yeah, swing it back around, set it back down. There we go. Check one more thing real quick. 38, 40 by 21, 60, maximum resolution at 60 frames per second. Dolby Vision is on. That's also within the app. Dolby Vision HDR, I should say. And of course you got all of the features like hyperlapse, time lapse, Dyna Zoom, slow motion video photo, all that good stuff. So yeah, main thing most importantly is can I use the DJI Mimo app with the iPhone 14 Pro Max and it's mounted it's working let's go all right guys that's going to conclude this video don't forget to like and subscribe for some more awesome content this is julian signing out peace